Miles Jones engages with Logan. The feed and a wide open goal for Ryder Garnsey as he walked the tightrope on the crease. And Garnsey, Garnsey one hand, scores! There's a flash of Ryder Garnsey. He loaded up with one hand from below goal line and came out top side and flings it past Reardon. Coates, as kind of this field general organizer, the, the tough part is with Lee out, the Redwoods have three legit dodging options on attack. He has some experience at the position. Garnsey slips it through. Second today for Ryder Garnsey. This one with a half a second on the clock. Jones charging ahead, six foot five, 240. The feed to Garnsey, and he puts it right in. Cannon's chaos later on will have the rain as well as Ryder Garnsey. Four for Henningberg. He was slid two and then backhanded home by Ryder Garnsey. Last couple of games, he's been awfully good. This is a pretty good defensive rotation by the Water Dogs, and the ball. Unfortunately for them, just kind of trickles to Garnsey, who wisely gets it up off the ground and gets it on cage before the defense and Ward can react. Wide open is Garnsey, who will make sure there is no comeback. Shot clock does not reset, so it's 20 to shoot, and Ryder Garnsey. Freeze it right here. You can see this defenseman is kind of looking off ball. He's trying to identify what's going on here. Meanwhile, his man, Garnsey, kind of slides into open space. Berkovic identifies that skip lane, gets it through, and Garnsey kind of a quick stick. ...have been in this position before, in fact, three games in a row. Unfortunately, they've been on the wrong side of all of them, and we're all tied up, Ryder Garnsey! Miles Jones, gorgeous little no-look feed to Garnsey, who again kind of catch, catches Jeffrey. Ball. Four and three with a plus-five score differential. You'd think would have a better chance as here, so we'll kind of get into that later. But you're gonna see Garnsey gonna drive up. He gets a switch on the short stick, Abbott, and a little rocker step there. You can see Abbott kind of expecting Garnsey to go back to his left. That subtle little body movement. Thank you, Paul. Well, this game started a long time ago, and there's a good effort, and it leads to a goal. Look, you gotta, you gotta try. You gotta. Sure, he's arguably the best face-off guy in the world. You gotta hustle. You gotta chase down ground, ground balls. You gotta throw checks. You gotta just make it as tiring as possible. You see the diving, leaping check there by Hartzell. That creates the loose ball. And Pinnell rolls on Manis. Skips it across for Garnsey. An extra move, and he sticks it. Patience here by Garnsey. Let's start with the skip pass by Pinnell even just to get that through, but Garnsey with that big windup, and he's known for shooting kind of awkward angles, awkward stick shooting angles. So there he kind of rolls, gets to his right hand. Moves it to Ryder Garnsey. Garnsey on the short stick, and McKay, he snuck it in! Ryder Garnsey! Needed to force a sharper angle. You're going to see McKay needs to engage earlier. He gets there late on Garnsey. He doesn't force him behind the goal early enough. You're going to see on this angle, you know, Garnsey right there has already got enough angle. McKay needs to get into his body and start pushing him earlier. Garnsey has such a knack for scoring those low angle shots. Keeping a little bit. Garnsey with an open look and he doesn't miss. You can see in transition, Kavanaugh just finds Garnsey in the middle of the field. You can see the Whip Snakes trying to point out their defensive matchups. Smith seemingly ran past Garnsey. You can see Muller. Henningberg. Long feed for Garnsey, and he finishes. They did the job on the defensive end. Henningberg and Garnsey take care of business on the other.